Hey what's up guys, how you all doing? So Samsung has released a new update for their Galaxy S9 and the S9 Plus. By the way, this is the S9 Plus. So the big highlight of this update is that it brings 480 FPS super slow-mo video functionality to the S9 and the S9 Plus. That means you get three slow motion modes. Uh, one is 240 FPS, second one is 480 FPS, and then you have the standard 960 FPS. Now the big advantage of 480 FPS is that you get twice as long as recording time so you can record I think around 12 seconds I'll do a demo of that later in this video so stay tuned for that and also there are some bug fixes AR emoji updates and this should also bring the security patch level of Android to July 2018 so let's go ahead and begin the update process on the Galaxy S9 Plus and then I'll give you a complete demo of what's new in the super slow mo mode and in case you haven't got the update don't worry guys the update will come sooner or later to your phone but here we go we are now downloading so this is a 960 fps super slow mo and the video length is 6 seconds 0 0.2 second in real life and this is in 480 FPS and the video length is 14 seconds, so more than double the length and in real life it should be around 0.4 seconds. So you get a lot more recording time in 480 FPS. And this is in 240 FPS and 240 FPS also has sound. So you have three different super slow motion modes on the Galaxy S9 and the S9 Plus. Alright guys, here we are back again and I hope that little demonstration helped you out in figuring out how different 480 FPS is from 960 FPS. To be really honest, I don't really see much difference. The video quality is as good as 960 FPS and both of these uh, videos are in 720p. But the big difference is that in 480 FPS you are able to record full 14 seconds of super slow mo video versus 6 seconds in 960 FPS. And that roughly translates to about 0.2 seconds in 960 FPS in real life and 0.4 seconds in 480 FPS in real life. Alright so let's go to the camera and I will show you how you can record in 480 FPS because Samsung does not give us a separate option. It's inside here in super slow-mo and it's a little bit confusing but I will try and explain to you guys my best. So if you want to record in 480 FPS you'll need to tap this settings icon and go to uh, super slow-mo and then select, then select this second option which says single take. So let's go back here and then you'll need to switch from auto to manual. And now you will be able to record in 480 FPS super slow-mo. All the other modes are in 960 FPS so if you want to record in super slow-mo once again go to settings and set your super slow-mo option to single take then you will need to set the option to manual now apart from that 480 FPS option we also have a slightly updated UI so let's go back to that multi take option and select this to auto no actually select it to manual and then start recording you can see this was slightly different before. Now I can't demonstrate to you just like that because I don't have a second Galaxy S9 running an older version of the uh, camera UI but this is how it's like in the newer software. I think this button was not there before or uh, maybe it was, it was there I don't remember it clearly. So you press that little right button and the phone will record a super slow mo clip. And you can do this again and again. And lastly this July update also updates the Android security patch level so we have the first July 2018 latest Android security patch level. Alright guys thank you for watching this video I hope this video was able to help you out. So thank you for watching please subscribe to me on YouTube if you like my videos press the like button and follow me on Instagram and on Facebook all the links are down in the video description. So thank you for watching do stay tuned for more videos like these and I will see you guys next time.